So let's create our first action and I'll call this one get albums for band. So this is going to be an HTTP get and let's create the action itself so that's public and we can have again I action result but if you remember like we did in the bands here we are going to be returning a collection of albums so we can instead create an action result of type I enumerable and the I enumerable we want is of course the albums DTO for that we need to bring in the namespace which is of course in our models and I'll call this one get albums for band and here we need to of course pass in the band ID so we know albums of what band we are going to be looking for so it's gonna be a GUID and band ID so first thing we need to make sure that the band ID is valid now in this case we can check if the band exists so we are not going to be wasting a database call because we need to make the same number of calls regardless so let's do an if statement and check if the band album repository that band exists is true here we have to pass in the band ID and it will return true if the band exists otherwise it returns false so here we are checking if it is false and if that's the case we will return not found because the band was not found now if the band is valid we can get the albums so let's create a variable I'll call it albums from repo and we'll go to our repository and we'll call the get albums method we are getting all albums of a single band so we need to pass in the band ID that we verify that exists so this call gets all the albums or all the entities from the database and now we will return a mapped entity to our DTO so we'll return an OK status and we'll go to our mapper and we will create a map and the map we want is for our I enumerable of albums DTO and of course our albums from repo so let's quickly recap so we check if the band exists and we use the band exists method we could of course just get the band based on the ID and then do the null check but like I said it would be one database call either way so we could just use band exists if the band exists we get the albums for that band and then we will return mapped I enumerable of albums DTO and it's going to be mapped to our entities in the albums from repo so let's run this and see if it works so let's make a get request we'll go to API slash bands and then we pass in the band ID so I'm just gonna paste a GUI there and this is for the band ABBA and then the API ends with another slash and albums so let's send this and here is the album for the band we only have one album for each of the bands so that's why we get one album and you can see we got back also the band ID which the user can use then to put together a query to get the band itself all right so this returns all the albums for a specific band and next let's create an action that will return a single specific album for a single band